Hi guys, my name's Zach Fox and this is MTV News! Where's V? Where is he? Yeah, okay. This is why we rehearse, guys. Hey, Sophie Kasai, thanks for coming down. Do you mind if I ask you a badly phrased question? Okay. What do you think of the idea of Chantelle Connolly potentially entering the Big Brother house herself? The celebrity one, with her ex being in there, Gemma Lucy and that. To be fair, I like Chantelle and I think she was a really good cast member on Geordie Shaw and I would love to see her go in that house, stir things up and give Gemma Lucy exactly what she needs. Okay, wicked thanks. One more badly phrased question. What do you think if of the... Oh, she's gone. Meet the exercise bike that lets you watch Netflix as long as you don't stop pedaling. What an incredible idea. We've all been there. You want to get into shape, you plan to go for a run, but instead you end up staying in and watching shows for four years. Well, now evil genius Ronan Byrne has invented a bike that will switch off Netflix as soon as you stop working out. You know what they should call it? The net cycle. Should they? That's rubbish. Byrne explained how he made what he calls the psych flicks on his Instructables blog. Oh, my name was actually better. He said, oh yes, it uses a stationary exercise bike connected to an Arduino Nano to control the streaming of Netflix on a PC. Unfortunately, it won't ever actually go on sale, so you'll have to make one yourself if you want to enjoy some of your favorite shows like House of Cardio, Unbreakable Kimmy Schwett, or Orange is the new bike. I only had two planned. If you guys know a friend who could use this machine, then tag them down below. If you don't have any friends at all, you can always tag me. Bella Thorne has clapped back at another online bully. Our Bella's never been shy to shoot down her online critics, as we've seen her do it time and time again. That's loaded. Well, here we are again, with a nasty tweet with a direct app mention to Bella herself. It reads, If your plan is to be edgy and controversial, then maybe you shouldn't have started your career on Disney Channel. Ooh, alright. I still don't understand people being nasty to total strangers online, and neither does Bella, who replies, You're right. When I was about to live on the streets with no money and a whole family, I should have turned down the offer. She handled that well, putting the bully in their place without being mean back. You're supposed to treat hatred with kindness. And I have to say that in future, this lovely little woman should keep her gorgeous little fingers to her sweet old self. And that is everything for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I've been Zach Fox. See ya. Later. <laughs>